Okay, so I thought I'd do a little follow-up video here. In the previous video, I showed you where you could go to the Rockwell website to download your free copy of the RS Logix 500 Micro Edition, the starter kit that they have available completely free, so people can get up to speed with their PLCs and their programming environment. So if you haven't watched that video yet, I'll put a link to it here uh, in the comment section below. Otherwise, your downloaded extraction file should be in your downloads folder. And there they are. So let's go ahead and double click those to start the extraction process. It should only take a, a, a few seconds really to extract these things. RS Links is probably the bigger of the three packages here because of all the EDS files it, it contains. So it should just take a second. Okay, so you can see it created a folder that has all the installation files that we're going to need. Great. So let's carry on and proceed with the emulator uh, extraction. Okay, that one was quick. And now we'll proceed with the RS Logix 500 Micro Light Edition extraction. Okay, well you can see it extracted that actually to a zip folder, so we'll, we will have to do one more extraction on that. So I'm just going to select the zip file, right click, and extract all click extract and you can see it's gone ahead and opened and there is a setup file there so why don't we get started on installing this stuff so I'm gonna might as well start with a Micrologix um, RS Logix 500 micro edition here so I'm just gonna double click that setup file click yes and it will begin to the installation here so this is really pretty straightforward for any standard type software that you would install uh, there'll be a series of screens that we'll have to click next through so we'll click next we'll accept the license agreement yes click next we can just use the default there next we'll do a complete installation and start installing okay so that's done we'll click finish and it's just going to open up a little readme uh, file thing here and we'll just close that off, that's fine. Okay, so let's proceed to install RS Links Lite. Okay, so we'll double click the folder and double click the setup file. We'll click yes. And we're gonna do the required steps. And we're gonna go ahead and install RS Links Classic. And we'll click next. Again, we'll accept the license agreement. And we can just click next again here. And we're not going to touch anything here. We're going to leave all the default settings just so it installs everything for us. And we're going to click install. Now this will take some time. It is a, a fairly comprehensive uh, software package here. So I'll probably pause the video and then we'll come back when we're all done. Okay, so if you get this little pop-up show up, would you like to install this device software? I just always trust software from Rockwall Automation and continue to install. Okay, so I've been installing for about 10 minutes or so, so I think we're getting close here. So I thought I'd turn the video back on. Um, it does take some time, like I said, to install these electronic datasheet files. Uh, so that that is what takes the, the majority of the time here. And that was it. So okay, so great. So we're not going to view the release notes, that's fine. We'll click finish. And it's running some kind of batch file in the background. And that's all we're going to need to do here. So we're going to go ahead and click exit to get out of here. And we'll go back and proceed to install the emulator software for RS Logix 500. We'll double click and click the setup file. And yes. And this shouldn't take nearly as long. Again, we'll click through the next. We'll accept the license agreement. Click next, complete installation, yes, install. Okay, so that's basically it. So all of our software should now be located under the programs Rockwell software. And you can see here is our RS Links. Here is our RS Logix 500 emulate. And we should be good to go. So I hope you found this video informative. Please do check us out at plcgurus.net become an active member in our community thanks for watching